Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe After Effects tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a hand-drawn animation. A circle, a square, an arrow, all of this can be done very easily in After Effects, as I just showed you here. Let's go ahead and start from scratch. Go to File, New, Project, of course, and I'm just going to go ahead and start creating a composition. Left-click on New Composition, presto. Doesn't matter what size it is, we just want to get the ball rolling. All right, good stuff. The first thing, I'm going to go to Workspace, and I'm going to make sure that it's selected to Standard for now, because we're going to go ahead and add, change it to Paint in a second. All right, Layer New, and we're going to go Solid. There we go. And in this case, we're going to just go ahead and make a white solid. There we go. We've got our background. Now, the next step is I'm going to go and just add a bit of text to this. I'm just going to type in Hand, Hand Drawn, so that you guys can see that I'm what I'm working with here. And, how the animation works. Okay, so I've got some text in there. That's purely optional. Now the big, the fun begins. Go up to Window, go to Workspace, change it to Paint. When you do that, you're going to get the Paint Panel and the Brushes Panel, which is what we want. Now, go ahead and double click on the white solid. It loads the background into the Layer Panel. Now I'm going to go up top here. I'm going to select my brush. And under my brush, I get two panels here in the Paint Panel, the Paint one and the Brushes. Under Paint, make sure that the duration is set to right on. It's very, very important. And under brushes, well, just select the brush that you want. I'm just going to use a hard round brush to start. And very importantly, change the spacing from 25% to 1% so you don't get the beaded look. Okay, with that out of the way, making sure you're clicked now here in the layer panel, I'm just going to go ahead and draw. So I'm going to draw a rectangle just so you guys can see what it looks like. Presto. You don't see anything yet. Go over here, move the playhead a little bit, take it to the beginning, hit spacebar. And boom, we've now got our hand drawn. Well, it's a little bit janky, but that's what it looks like. If you don't like it, you can always redo it. And if you want to change any of the effects in terms of the size of the paint, so if you want a thicker brush or a thinner brush, you'll see here that I've just opened up under white solid. I can go ahead in here and just and make some changes. So if I want to go ahead and change the color to like blue, for example, it would do it. And then now I've got a blue brush. And of course, you can change things like the width and all of those things in here. Also, if you find that you don't have the right size, you can go ahead and adjust the scale so you can make it bigger or smaller. And again, just hit spacebar and you'll see it happen. That's all there is to it to creating hand-drawn animations. Thanks for watching.